Good evening. A longtime girls soccer coach at Anderson High School faces accusations of bullying. The school is standing behind him, but parents and players say they don't think the school, st uh, rather he should still be in coaching. Nine on your side, reporter Tom McKee is live at the school with both sides of the story you'll see only on nine. Tom? Well, Clyde, we're talking about Bill Miller, an Anderson grad and longtime coach of the girls team since 2005, that girls varsity team right here. Now, this is a summary of what allegedly occurred, prepared by a lawyer who wants the district not to retain Miller. But the district, well, the district is fighting back. Now, Miller has coached both boys and girls soccer at Anderson, has an overall record of 125 wins, 47 losses, and 32 ties. He was still on the field today with his team. What's being contested occurred last season. Alleged conduct, the attorney for the players and parents, is calling outrageous, harassing, bullying, intimidating, and sexist. Extremely foul language, uh, uh, demeaning language to females, um, calling them names that just wouldn't be acceptable. Um, to any of us, um, uh, getting in one girl's face so closely that he, his spittle flew on her face as he screamed at her, uh, telling the girls that they were not to share any of this with their parents, that what, stayed, what happened with the team stayed with the team. Now, an investigation by the schools did not support the bullying claim, but the district did issue this statement saying that there appeared to be reasonable evidence that Miller used unintentional profanity in his coaching duties, and that resulted in a written, written reprimand. Again, what we're talking about is physical and verbal abuse, nothing more. Coming up new at 6, more on that statement from the school district in backing Miller. Tom McKee, 9 on your side, live at Anderson High School. Thank you, Tom. And